live from beautiful Stake of America Stadium in Chuckett, South Carolina, where they love to say, keep pounding, ever since the Tommy DeFist incident back in 13. We all remember where we were that day. I still remember the beautiful screens. Remember, in the NFL, we encourage you to play with your food. He's probably lining up against you. The San Francisco 49ers take on the Carolina Panzers. Welcome to NFL Game Day. Grim Blitzrow here. Let's listen in on the sidelines and hear what the team's captains have to say. If the sound of a torn Achilles followed by laughter and taunting brings a smile to your face, you are tuned to the right place. Hi everyone, Grim Blitzrow and the MFL crew is coming to you live on game day. Bricks, any uh, thoughts on today's game? Um, I thought I had one, but uh, I think I might have forgotten it. Oh, I remember. Uh, I forgot who's playing today. Careful what you ask for, Grim. Oh, good run. He nearly broke it open, Bricks. Yeah. I nearly blew three times the legal limit last night leaving the stadium. And I nearly did not get arrested, get thrown face first into a paddy wagon, get taken for a rough ride. And I nearly did not have prison sex in lockup last night. Nearly. And it could be. And he just. Ouch! What is this? Annie's wrestling? Second down and seven. I, I, one. Don't make any mistakes here, or they'll kick the shit out of you in the locker room. Straight through the uprights. They need a good return here to set up the offense. They're going to be able to return this one. Sends him to the ground with an exclamation point. And a well-placed cleat. And it's first and ten. <laughs> Great play by the defense. Results in an inter- you can't keep a good meal. Oh, man. Bricks, you got to love a player who goes down fighting. First down. Give this guy a few catches and... Oh, that was totally uncalled for. And that's why we love the NFL. And it's first and ten. And that's the way to get the sticks moving. He picks up five yards on that play. Second down and five. And he stayed with the receiver and deflected the ball. Third down and five. Well, it looks like he wanted to run before he caught it. You gotta keep your eye on the ball. Come on, you dirtbag. You gotta make that catch. And the punter takes a break from knitting on the sidelines to come in and punt. His knitting is superb, Grim. That cross stitching, unbelievable. And he just lets that one go. He says, no, thank you. And the defense downs it. And it's first and ten. Oh, he just got crushed. Second down and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. 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 This guy's a brick shit out. Now the offense is getting kills. This is really a violent game, guys.
Third down in. The heart of the quarterback's tight spirals and magnetic person. It's not how many times you fall. It's how you get back up. Yeah, in this particular case, I'm thinking defibrillators and 100 cc's of adrenaline. And it's first and ten. He took a beef boost injection. Now watch him stomp all over his opponent. You know, you gotta put the buzz on the MVP conversation breaks. Got more kills than anyone in the league right now. Yeah, you make a good point. He might catch him. Oh, you fat little mutant. Boom, dead and down. He delivered the freaky fast ham sandwich with extra mustard for the death blow. Speaking of ham sandwiches, I'm gonna go grab one. You want anything? No, still working on my salami here, Bricks. Thanks. That's what she said. Ah, oh, nah, didn't work that time. It was close, though. Yep. First down and one. Say goodnight to that guy, Bricks. Ah, uh, goodnight to that guy, Bricks. You're an idiot. The offense is down to their last running back. When he bites the dust, they can only pass. Eh, yeah, well, at least they don't have to forfeit, man. That's right, but now the defense can focus on killing the receivers. And that'll be second down and four. I'm going to say maybe three yards, but a tough three yards. And that'll bring up third and one. Hot one, hot two, hot, 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 hot. And that play went nowhere fast. No game. They're going for it on fourth down. Hot one, hot two, hot, 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 hot. And he runs it in for the touchdown. It should be easy, but with kickers, you never know. The kick is good. As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. When you get knocked down, you got to get right back up and fight. Uh, what about when you get knocked up? What do you do then? Run. First and ten. Oh, with a punishing hit. Second down and seven. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot, hot. Richards. Don't try to get fancy here. Just put the ball down and kick it. In that order, Grim? It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuffed burrito from Taco Hell. It's anyone's game at the end of quarter one. The teams are lined up for the kickoff. He sets up for the return. Let's see if he can break one wide open. If there were any functioning brain cells before that hit, they're gone now. He's going to have the IQ of a rutabaga after that hit. 
And it's first and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot eight. And another interception. This quarterback is going to listen to Joe. Oh, what a great defensive play that was, Bricks. Kind of like, oh, no, that was totally unnecessary. <laughs> I got to see that one again. It was also freaking awesome. I hope they have raincoats in the front row because that was splattering everywhere. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot. Great play by the defense. It's not too often a quarterback gets rejected. That's why that's the position I originally tried out for. I want to know what it's like for other people to accept you. Now that went from a joke to making me feel feelings. Stop it. This isn't a place to feel feelings. This is football. Boom, dead and down. He delivered the freaky fast ham sandwich with extra mustard for the death blow. Speaking of ham sandwiches, I'm going to go grab one. You want anything? Now, still working on my salami here, Bricks. Thanks. That's what she said. Ah, ah, didn't work that time. It was close, though. Yep. And it's first and ten. It's two yard run before he stopped. And that'll be second and eight to go. Hot one, hot two, hot, hot, hot. That ball just sliced through the defense like butter. Oh, and he breaks free and has nothing but open field in front of him. First and ten. And that's the way you play a guy. Nice coverage. Second down and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. Third down and, well, good luck. That's the way to move the chains. That's good for a first down. This game is open. Mm, I don't remember that being an officially sanctioned NFL rule. Third down in the offense, and they've had enough. The offense jumps on sides and attacks the ref. Third down and forever. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. I ate a piece of licorice once and got a shot like that. It wasn't licorice, you idiot. It was the freight cords of the leaf blower. Well, it was a red cord and it looked like licorice. The point is, uh, I forgot my point. No, they couldn't pick up a first down, so now they have to punt. And he booted a high arcing rainbow. And he's got, oh, and he looks like he just saw 400 scary movies after that hit. It sounds like my off season. And it's first and ten. Oh, this was their dirty trick. He's leaving a wake of destruction in his path, and the body toll continues to climb. Good. And he shuffled his feet so well on that play, he should go to lost wages. It looks like we've got a penalty here. And it's first and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot. I knew when the coach said the offense was going to be explosive this week, he meant it literally. Second down and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot three. And he 
Elliott reels that one in for a first down to keep the... Oh, mama. Just call him Cap'n Crunch. Another one bites the dust. And it's first and ten. Look out. That's an all-out attack. On and that unsportsmanlike play of the day brought to you by the good folks at Speedy's drive through Funeral Parlor Service located just off the Beltway exit five. <laughs> The offense has only two quarterbacks remaining on the roster. They better be careful because when those guys die, it's forfeit city. First down and six. Out and he laterals at the last second. Nifty move there. And that'll be second and eight to go. Dead and down. He just sent a message with that hit. Yeah, the message was you can't kill the messenger because he's going to kill you. But then he won't be able to read the message because the messenger killed him. Ah, yeah. uh, going in circles. Now the offense is running low on running backs. They have only two left. You need to conserve those runners now and consider passing more. Third and four. Don't want to make any mistakes here. Just kick the ball through the upright, for God's sake. It's good. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if the defense can hold them. Not a bad kick, but not a great one either. Well, his nickname is lukewarm. And he's proud of that. And that was a bone crusher right there, folks. And it's first and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. Second down and more than the QB would like. Hot one. Hot. You ever get hit in the head with a boat all grim? Nope. Well, I have on several occasions. Not surprising. Multiple times on each occasion. Not surprising. And trust me, that hit was worse. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. And that's perfect coverage. Nice deflection. Well, here comes the punting unit. You know, punters really do know how to party, Bricks. Yeah? Oh, yeah, I have pictures that, uh, well, maybe actually shouldn't discuss this on here. He's got the ball now and is going to try and score. Pow! With the brain scrambler! It's a tie game at the end of quarter two. The teams are deadlocked in a fierce struggle today. We'll be right back with today's halftime show brought to you by Monsatan Industries. Eat their delicious Franken food. Hey, throw in the half. Can you pick me up a soil and beer? Third quarter, we are all tied up and set to kick off the second half. Uh, speaking of all tied up, Grim, how many of them elephant lacks in a belt did I take? I feel like I'm sitting on not Vesuvio right now. Oh, one false move, and I'm gonna blow! <laughs> They're looking for a good return after giving up points. Let's see how they do. Yeah, let's see if they always suck or if that was just a one-time thing. When it feels like to have your teeth removed without Novocaine. If I had all my teeth knocked out like that, I'd have them made at the dice, Grim. It'd be fun to gamble with my own teeth. <laughs> Don't you just love the sound of bones snapping and cracking? I mean, when they're not yawn. Second down and nine. Said they'd 
blow up the defense today. <laughs> he was right. Third down and nine. play defense well, of course he he could have had an interception returned it for a touchdown and changed the entire game but i don't want to nitpick and he got it off that's a decent punt and he snags the punt and looks for open feet if that hit didn't cripple him it certainly left skid marks First and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot. And the defense gets another pick. Man, rough day. And he scores! And they line up for the extra point. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stop burrito from Taco Hell. Let's see if they can keep the momentum going and keep these fans happy and uh, or bloodthirsty, whichever. Oh, with the brain scrambler. It's first and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. Oh, what a brutal hit. Second down and nine. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. 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 The defense better look out. The offense called the beast boost dirty trick. Bam. Say goodnight to that guy, Bricks. Uh, Good night to that guy, Bricks. You're an idiot. First and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. He picks up nine yards on that catch. <laughs> and that'll bring up second and one. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. 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 Yeah, I've had it. I'm running out of excuses. Oh, man. His neck vertebrae just got crunched. Sounded like a gorilla sitting on a bag of potato chips. As they say at the deli, who's next? Uh, uh, can I get a Swiss on rye with the... Uh... Boom, dead and down. Nothing more to say about this guy except maybe a eulogy. Ah, uh, well, he was a violent alcoholic, a terrible father, and uh, he did some nasty things to dogs. <clears throat> but, uh, I mean, he was a great ball player. Uh, you know, that's really what counts at the end of the day, right? And it's first and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot. And he was stuck to him like glue. Second down and ten. Oh, and the defense jumps on sides and attacks the QB. If this guy could talk before he died, what do you think he'd be saying, Bricks? Psycho killer! Just to say, what the fuck, 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 fuck! The offense lost another quarterback on the previous play and have only two left before they have to forfeit. Yeah, but on the bright side, win. they save a ton of money by not having to pay those guys anymore. Uh, the, the funeral expenses, that is. Second down and ten. And the offense jumps off sides to kill the ref. They say, we're mad as hell and not going to take it anymore. Second down and ain't gonna happen, partner. And there's 
another pick. Man, this quarterback must have learned a lot about sharing when he was in school. Yeah, that's why he's so popular with the other kids. The ones boom, dead and down. He delivered the freaky fast ham sandwich with extra mustard for the death blow. Speaking of ham sandwiches, I'm gonna go grab one. You want anything? No, yeah, still working on my salami here, Bricks. Thanks. That's what she said. Ah, ah, didn't work that time. It was close though. Yep. And it's first and ten. Catches it. I had this guy on my fantasy team last week. I lost so much money on him, not to mention my kneecaps. My loan shark is very anal about collecting my money on time, Graham. This is your brain, and this is your brain on Berserker Drop. Oh, a great play by the defense. The receiver didn't stand a chance. Second down and ten. Cornerback throws another pick. He should have eaten his sleep. Oh, the unstoppable force meets the explodable object. And it's first and ten. Oh, and he laterals the ball to the player behind him. And he breaks away. And the crowd goes wild. Touchdown. Touchdown. Well, this should be an easy chip shot extra point, but you never know with kickers. <laughs> the kick is good! As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. The home team is feeling confident as they get the kickoff into the air. Scoring makes anyone confident. It certainly does, Bricks. It certainly does. High five! <laughs> And it's first and ten. At this point, with multiple intercepts, man, what a hit that was! And it's first and ten. Second down and long. The lineman swants the ball away with those meaty paws. What? It looks so snugly. And that brings us to the end of the third quarter. They'll need to fire on all cylinders to make a comeback in the final quarter. Third down and the punter is warming up. He is fighting for every yard, and he's off to the races. Oh, what a run there. Touchdown. No one was going to stop him. And here comes the extra point attempt. Straight through the uprights. The best kind of kick is when it's right after a score. Hey, speak for yourself. I'm usually the one who gets kicked after scoring. Ooh, hope he's got a good chiropractor. Kind of 
When in a hurry up offense, the offense needs to run out of bounds or take a timeout to stop the clock. Quarterback threads the needle for a first down. And it's first and ten. That ball was almost intercepted. And the hurry-up offense wears out the defense since they can't rest their players. And that's another... Oh, that was a big hit. Hey, Bricks, I'll bet you took a lot of shots like that over your career. Ah, uh, let's see. About a quarter after three, Grim. <laughs> but my watch is a bit slow. You do me, And it's first and ten. <laughs> and he picks up maybe four on that play. Second down and six. And the defense goes for the juggler and rushes. To it's not how many times you fall. It's how you get back up. Yeah, in this particular case, I'm thinking defibrillators and 100 cc's of adrenaline. Yeah, an eight ball wouldn't hurt either. Did somebody say cocaine? The offense is losing quarterbacks faster than teams lose their minds at spring break. They're down to their last QB before they have to forfeit. And it's first and ten. NFL keeps pounding out the death hits on WMFL 98.8, the greatest hits of all time. Huh? Did you just say greatest hits? Wham! Second down in a very lot. And the runner is leaving a wake of destruction in his path, and the body toll continues to climb. Oh, with the brutal hit! lost their final running back. Lucky for them, they're on defense now. They're lucky to survive so much bad luck, carnage, and death, Grim. And the offense goes into the hurry-up formation to try to conserve time. He's not going down. And he snatches that one out of the air for a first down. See if a man from prison just came out of the field. That's the ref, idiot. Oh. Let's see what the penalty is. And the offense goes into their two-minute drill. Which coincidentally happens to be Brits Matt's stupid time. That's why the girls call And he just nailed him right on the numbers for a touchdown. Well, this shouldn't be easy, but with kickers, you never know. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double step burrito from Taco Hell. When you give up points, you need to get them back. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if they can make them pay. First and ten. Second down in a mile. Like he just ran into the line at the DMV. And guess what, Grim? That line ain't moving. Yeah, that was kind of my point, Bricks. Third down, and the QB is saying his prayers. The offense just burned the defense pretty hard on that one. Man, it's still edible, though. Just got to scrape off the charge pipe. 
back. And the two-minute warning sounds. There's not much time left at all. Boring, but smart. Time to punt. Whoa, whoa, you can't say that on the radio. And he put all of his foot into that one. He's got the ball now. Let's see what he does with it. If that hit didn't cripple him, it certainly left skid marks. With the vicious kill. Did you know light hits are one of the leading causes of death for mutants over 25? I didn't know that. Yeah, right below attending bachelor parties and owning a Sam Schwann Galaxy phone. And it's first and ten. And the quarterback throws a murder ball, which will slice its way through any defensive player trying to block it. He broke free and has open field in front of him. And they take their first time out. Well, how predictable. Surprise us next time. Call the time out during halftime. He says, I'm taking you with me. In a hurry up offense, there is no huddle, so neither team can put their players on the bench. Does the QB know which team he's on? I don't even know where I'm at. Oh, what a punishing hit that was. And that's how you make a guy remember your name and your shoe size. Because he just walked all over him. And it's first and ten. Don't try to get fancy here. Just put the ball down and kick it. In that order, Grim? Straight through the uprights. Here comes the kicker. Oh, I can't wait to hear this. What's the kicker, Grim? Uh, this guy in the field. Oh, I thought you were going to tell me a story like, here's the kicker. When I turned on the light, it wasn't a bra in my bed. It was a chimp wearing a wig. When in a hurry-up offense, the offense needs to run out of bounds or take a timeout to stop the clock. This guy's going to get mugged in the locker room by his team after the game. And the quarterback signals for a hurry-up offense. Hey, Grim, what's the hurry-up offense? There's no huddle. The offense calls plays at the line of scrimmage and plays really fast. What? And like bricks his bowels, he is loose and heading for the end zone. He could go all the way. Bingo! Bingo! I just hit that mutant bingo! And all I was missing was his number for the last three plays. Talk about luck. I don't know which The quarterback goes into a hurry-up offense. He's looking for a quick score. Aren't we all, Grim? Aren't we? And another interception. This quarterback is going to listen to Joy Division and pow! And how about a little dirt sandwich? <laughs> the Panzers roll over the opposition and chuck up a win. Man, they take them like Poland at 30. It was total and complete and utter domination. And speaking of domination, look at the stilettos on that cheerleader. Oh, I'd like her to walk on my back. 
I'll tell you what, I'll pay you to do a river dance on your back with golf shoes. And let's go to the MVP to hear him let loose with some verbal diarrhea about just how special he is. Don't want dirt and the blood on your tire. Once again, the folks at Eagle SM thank our viewing audience and the Mutant Football League for allowing us to telecast this sports presentation. This is Grim Blitzrow with Brickhead Mulligan and Bricks Jr. signing off. Today's game was brought to you by Comcrack Entertainment. They're not happy until you're not happy.